Hello, and thank you for watching. This video right here, I put it together to show you how to make a veggie burger using the Vitamix. Now, some of you may have saw my photo that I posted a few days ago on Facebook where I showed you the veggie burger I made using the Vitamix blender. Um, I'm going to declare that veggie burger a prototype because there was something missing when I ate it, when I ate it and tried it out. So I made another one and this time around I perfected it and made it taste a whole lot better than how it tasted the first time. So with this video, we're going to put together a veggie burger. We're going to show you how to make a veggie burger with the Vitamix blender. And this time around, you're going to see how it's done and you're going to get the perfected one, not the prototype, but the real deal. So sit back, stay tuned, and we're going to turn this blender on and we're going to make us a veggie burger. First thing we're going to do, we're going to start with some fresh oats. Put some of that in there. I didn't really measure, just just uh, just a little bit or just enough. sunflower seeds make sure they're raw sunflower seeds and not the salted kind baking but I just put a little bit not a lot and add some ground flax seeds that's pretty much the secret to holding the veggie burgers together part of it you know. next up we got some fresh Swiss chard in there it's organic by the way some fresh kale organic kale that is next a uh, fresh beet you won't see me cut it up on the camera but I'll cut a couple of slices in there and you'll see um, see the big red things poking through the greens the, those are the beets and lastly I cut up some red onion we'll put that in there now for part the missing ingredients the main ingredients that is we're gonna get to those right now here's the secret to making the veggie burger taste like something we're gonna add seasoning we're gonna add our seasonings to this we're gonna pre-season it before we turn the blender on now I'm gonna start with garlic powder fresh garlic powder put some of that in there a little more okay that's good next we're gonna put some what we got the magic remedy of all your pain turmeric put some turmeric in there about this dude you might want to give him a holler follow him on Facebook or Instagram if you have Instagram flavor God everything flavor we're gonna put some of that in there too that makes a difference yeah okay it's time to turn it on please forgive me because this thing's gonna be pretty loud and it may be annoying but please bear with me I just want to show you the process so we're going to cut it on. 
at one. We're gonna turn it up to, I say, about five.
dealing with regular table salt. I, I get Himalayan pink salt or sea salt. There is the finished product. One veggie burger and some purple sweet potato fries. Sorry that the sweet potato fries were not featured in the demonstration, but it's all good. Um, but um, anyway, hope you enjoyed it. This is the dinner for me, my dinner for the night. Purple sweet potato fries and one veggie burger with barbecue sauce. Highly recommend the barbecue sauce. It makes a difference. And um, hope you enjoy because I know I'm about to enjoy. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching. Be sure to follow me on Twitter at 4 Star General.